Somebody's on the clock up here with the girls. How you doing? Yeah. How you doing? All right, how are you? Doing pretty good. You're not allowed up here on this part of the trail, though. Is there no trespassing sign? You're See, fine. here's the here's the tag number. And then, wait a minute, wait a minute. When I first started saying this, some of you guys got a kick out of it, but others thought I was crazy. <laughs> this is what I said. No hanky-panky on the job, guys. All right? No hanky-panky on the job. No hanky-panky on the job. Not on my tax dollars. All right? And after you see this video from David Hilltop, you're going to see why I say things like that. Here we go, folks. We're up here at that Helen trail they just made. Where the game gun range is, there's a sign down there. As you're pulling in, it says no vehicles past this point. But pretty cool up here. Gun range. So there's no vehicles past the point where you come in the road because it's a walking trail now. But if you're walking around, look. Somebody's on the clock. Up here with the girl. How you doing? Uh, how you doing? All right, how are you? Doing pretty good. Oh, you're Mr. Huff, ain't you? Yeah. How do you, you how do you know that? Oh, you got a name for yourself around town. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We all living here 58 years. You get to, people get to know you. Oh, okay. Well. When the police take you in their police department and threaten you. They threatened you. Hell yeah, they have. Well, who's writing you? Chief of police. Chief of police? Yeah, yeah. Well, hell. Hockey. Oh. One before him. Well, but the cop, the cop that took me in there, he still works here. Oh, well, yeah, but that's something you need to take up with the police department. Howdy, sir. Hands. How you doing? Pretty good. How you doing, sir? What's your name? Stephen McVeigh. You got a badge number? I do. It's 1704. 1704. Yes, sir. You're on the clock. Yes, sir. I was just wondering. There's a sign up here mm -hmm. that says uh, no vehicles past this point, mm -hmm. and you're up here in a vehicle. I was actually up here talking to her in reference to business. Matter of fact, you're not allowed up here neither. Why is that? It says trail open. The trail's down there, not up here. Sure it is. It took right up no, here. Right back down there. Did you see right. a no trespassing sign anywhere? You're not allowed to put on this part of the trail. Though. Is there no trespassing sign? See, Probably not. Know. He's got the blue line phone. You're see, here's the, here's the here's the tag number. And then wait a minute, wait a minute. Let me tell you guys why I began saying no hanky panky on the job. One day I was watching the news. So when SB 1421, a new law that came out that allowed us to get records from police officers to find out what it is exactly they're doing, and we get to look at some of the complaints. Apparently, one of the officers here in Bakersfield, where I live, he was sending crotch shots of his genitalia over to some woman after he had arrested her husband on domestic violence. All of this while he was on duty, trying to hook up with victims. Folks, he's still on the force. Why do things like this happen, folks? Because many of you are not shown these things on mainstream media or your local news. It takes people like us picking up cameras and recording, asking questions. And it's going to take you to hold your public officials accountable. Because I am not Superman, I just can't be everywhere. And neither can David Hilltop. You guys go subscribe to David Hilltop's channel. Let them know I sent you. And remember folks, remind them all, no hanky panky on the job. Alright guys, thank you for tuning in. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. We have police interaction videos that we can all learn from. Together we're going to make this country and this world a better place. Alright guys, have a great day. Peace.